Our third finalist for the 2010 Harlan Hill Trophy is University of Central Missouri senior quarterback, Eric Zerneski. A native of Montgomery City, Missouri, Zerneski set a Division II record this season with 5,207 passing yards while also leading the nation in total offense and touchdown passes with 46. He threw for more than 300 yards 10 times this season and completed 66% of his 670 pass attempts. His efforts led Central Missouri to an 11-3 record, a number eight national ranking, and into the quarterfinals of the Division II playoffs. He was selected as the Dactronics first team quarterback, Offensive Player of the Year for Dactronics, and first team AFCA All-American. He shattered every school and conference passing record for a season and career, including 12,847 career passing yards, 1,043 career completions, and 107 touchdown passes. His career passing yardage total ranks fourth in Division II history. And tonight, he hopes to give the MIAA its fifth Harlan Hill Trophy winner, the Central Missouri quarterback, Eric Zerneski. All three of you finalists, you've had spectacular seasons, spectacular careers, and you've helped build Division II football to the level it stands today. And only one of you will be named the Harlan Hill winner tonight but all three of you are winners or you wouldn't be at this head table. My father wants you finalists to know and all the people here that he is very proud and honored for someone to represent a trophy that bears his name. So thank you. The winner of the 2010 Harlan Hill Trophy as Division II College Football Player of the Year is Eric Zerneski of Central Missouri. Thank you, thank you all so much. Wow, uh, what an honor. It is just, uh, I had a great past week with these two guys, getting to know them a lot. They're very great people and great athletes, as you guys all saw up there on the board. Great career numbers, you know, and I just want to con congratulate all three of you guys here too as well, getting inducted in the Hall of Fame, what, a, what an honor. And uh, you know, it's just a, it's a great event here. I had a great time this week, and I'd like to thank everybody that, uh, you know, is a part of this event and making this, you know, the best event that uh, at, at Division II level, like Sean Jones said, all week. You know, it's a, just a very exciting time for all the players here. And, <clears throat> you know, uh, it's just amazing to have my name put on that trophy, uh, you know, with some of the best athletes that have ever played this game, and it's a great honor. You know, like I said, I have to thank everyone that, uh, you know, makes this event possible and also everyone at uh, the University of Central Missouri um, just to get to play, you know, college football. Is, it's an amazing, it's the best game in the world. You know, I have to thank all the administration there, the media, you know, Sean Jones, uh, Jerry Hughes back there. And, uh, you know, it's just a great honor. Also, I have to thank all of my coaches, especially uh, – <sighs> Excuse me, especially my head coach, Jim Savota, and offensive coordinator. You know, I, I wouldn't be here up here on this stage today without him. Um, you know, I also have to thank my family, all of you that are here today, all my other family. You know, this is just a great honor, and thank you guys for sharing this day with me, especially my wife. You know, uh, love you with all my heart. Um, also, have to thank all of my teammates because there's no way I'd be here today without them. You know, and. It's just a storybook ending to a great career that I had at the University of Central Missouri, and thank you all. Um, about the entire experience, you know, I'll, I'll definitely remember the fact I got to share everything with my family. You know, was, you know I'm very fortunate on all the support I was shown and given throughout my career. And, you know, it's a, it's a fun time being around everybody here at, at the multi here at the university. And, you know, it's, it's, gonna, it's just a great honor. You know, it's definitely hard to believe, you know, to be, like I said earlier, be amongst, you know, be the best player in Division II college football. You know, it's just, just amazing to hear that, amazing to see that on a trophy, and, you know, with my name beside it. You know, it's just a great honor, and I'm still surprised every day I wake up and see that trophy sitting there. And, 
you know, I, and like you said earlier, you know, I got to give a lot of credit to my teammates and everybody that helped me get this far. Well, you know, going to the banquet, uh, there was definitely, definitely a little bit of doubt there. You know, there was a guy, a couple, a couple great guys that you know were up for the, uh, nominated for the award as well. And you know, with two guys coming out of the same division, the same conference, you know, the same region, you know, you never know if the votes could split. And it was the closest voting ever in the, uh, you know, the award history. So, it, it, you know, it was. It was it was a lot of nerves, but you know, I was excited to be there, and it was just a great honor to be there amongst the, with those two great, great players that were beside me that day. Well, you know, it, it takes a lot of hard work when you know just just playing college football. So, you know, to, to uh, win this award by you know putting in all that hard work in the summer, in the in the spring, you know, in the fall, you know, watching film, you know, it's just uh, you know it's uh, you know very rewarding. You know, definitely to, to receive an honor like this. No player can do anything by themselves, especially in a sport like football. You got 11 guys on defense and 10 other guys on offense. And, you know, I have to give a lot of credit to all my teammates and especially, you know, my coaches and, you know, each and every person that was involved in the university. Each and every week we took the field. You know, I couldn't have done any of this without them. And, you know, I just, I'm just blessed that, you know, I got the opportunity to come to Central and play with the great guys that are on our team. And, you know, it's, it was a fun four and a half years here and hopefully I can keep giving back to the university.